Hi Kevin, hi Jack, it's really nice to have you here today. So I'm curious to know, with the world changing, what does the future of banking look like? So, in the future of banking has limitless possibilities, right? We just heard from the Singapore government that we're launching this 5G trial uh, in Sentosa Island, where you're going to have driverless cars and people cleaning the parks from a remote control room. With all that kind of bandwidth on computing power, there's so much that we can bring to our customers in the future. Mm. People have been talking about hyper-personalization to the segment of one. At UOB, we call this the digital adaptive banking, where we see a future that we can bring dynamic user interface and user experience, where basically mm. what Jack likes to see, what Earn likes to see, right, on your app itself can be different. Mm. And you as a customer will have a choice to it. You know, like what Kevin mentioned about the app being personalised, um, adaptive, it's also important that we bring value to our customers. So making that banking experience extremely rewarding. We're very proud that we have launched Rewards Plus program on UOB tomorrow. It's Singapore's first and largest rewards program. We have partner Faith uh, to provide the largest partnership uh, ecosystem in Singapore. So I think the whole variety is there. It's personalised to you. Last but not least, the ability to have simple and transparent display of all your rewards as well as cashback all in one place in UOB tomorrow makes the management of how many reward points I have, when will it expire, how much cashback I'll have, uh, even simpler. Okay, and how can digital and physical touch points serve the needs of our customers at different stages of their lives? There's another one uh, pillar, right, that we, we see is very important. It's what we call the growth uh, graduation model. That basically customers at different stages of life have different needs, right, that evolves. And if you have the data, you're able to recommend the next best product to the customers, right? at the right specific moment that they need. That's right? right. So it's not about only the acceleration of the digital transformation, but it's also important for now and in the future for us to be transforming that physical uh, interaction and that physical touch point, uh, what we call also the omni-channel strategy, leveraging data like what you mentioned, uh, as well as tech to ensure uh, seamless on and off uh, interaction and engagement with our clients. So for example, if you are a millennial like yourself, maybe if you are new to investing, um, you know, you can start your wealth journey um, simply with Simple Invest uh, on UOB tomorrow from as affordable as $100. And you can choose from three solutions based on whatever your objective is, whether it's for liquidity, whether it's for income, or whether it's for growth. Trick question coming up. Investing is for millionaires. A, or investing is for everyone. B, A or B? B. B, oh. I'm quite sold by your speech. Sign me up. Uh, could you also share what is your favourite feature of the Tomorrow app? My favourite feature is definitely simple wealth. Okay, I personally committed money to it, Jack. I hope you do well. Yeah, please so remind investment managers. I, I like the fact that it's so clean, simple for customers basically to look at investments with the right uh, investment principles, right? Uh, not trying to time the market, put in investments on a regular monthly basis. So, simple investment. So for me, my most frequently used feature is definitely payments because I use a pay now to pay friends um, uh, and family or even uh, uh, at the merchants. But my favourite current feature now is the Mighty FX feature because since VTL has been open, I booked my flight to London Lucky and I've you. put in an order watch uh, for the conversion rate that I would like uh, for my Mighty FX. So that's my current uh, favourite feature now. Okay, I think when you're talking about PNR, right, this is a small side note, but what I like is the amount of like skins that you have. Yes! And oh. I play around the skins a lot. And I do send it to my colleagues. Really? Yeah. <laughs> it's no, kind of I, I love it personally. Yeah. And you know, we spend time putting at the bottom whether it's, you know, having a my tea time or whether it's congratulations oh, or thank whether you, it's happy my birthday. Share. Thank yeah, you, yeah, yeah. my share. So we, we put quite a lot of thought behind yeah. a lot of this UX, UI and the little differences to hopefully make payments fun for mm, everyone. Right. Yeah. Design is so important. Yes. Designing the experience, right? Yeah. Curating this little bit of match. Oh, it's good. like the little things, but I feel like customers do take note of that yes. as well. Yeah. yeah, this has been extremely insightful. I think I've learned a lot today. I guess how I, what I want to ask is like for both of you, how would you describe the UB app in three words? Oh. Well, I would say that uh, it is simple personalised, uh, as well as rewarding. Or I would say three words, just make tomorrow yours. I would go for make tomorrow yours. 